Anya from Cooking with Plants and today I'm making a recipe from my Vegan Made Easy cookbook and it's one of my favorite salad dressings. It's the Caesar dressing on page 115 and it is so delicious and creamy. It doesn't use any oil, no animal products so you know there's no cholesterol in this and it's really healthy for you. So super simple to make. Get yourself a small blender to get started. And what I've done is put in one cup of cashew nuts. And to this, I'm also adding one cup of plant-based milk. So today I'm using almond milk, but you could use any plant milk of your choice, whether it's soy milk or some oat milk, some rice milk would be great as well. Next, I'm adding in two tablespoons of nutritional yeast flakes. If you don't have these on hand, you could use a little bit of tahini paste, some sesame paste, and maybe just a little dash of soy sauce as well, just to give it that cheesy, creamy sort of flavor that's going to really make this zing. So to this, I'm also adding half a teaspoon of Dijon mustard. And I absolutely love garlic, so I'm adding in one large clove of garlic to this. One tablespoon of fresh lemon juice and some salt and pepper to taste. So I'm adding half a teaspoon of coarse Celtic sea salt and just a dash of black pepper. And then this is ready to blend up. And that's it, your dressing's done. This is so quick and easy to make and it just tastes so delicious. And I love making this dressing in my smaller blender. It just seems to make it extra creamy. So I need to give this a taste test. It smells delicious. Mmm. Oh, all those flavors just combine into the most creamy, healthy and delicious dressing that you could ever make. It just makes anything delicious. I even put this on some baked potatoes or sometimes I even mix it with rice and some beans. But to make a traditional Caesar salad, this is a fantastic dressing that you can make at home in just minutes. Let me know what you think. Remember, you can print this recipe off my website at cookingwithplants.com. And I look forward to you joining me for the next recipe. Bye for now.